Hello, this is Paresh here again. In this video, I'm going to show you how to design a 4 cross 1 max or 4 cross 1 multiplexer. As we know, a multiplexer is a device which has 2 to the power n input terminals, n select lines, and 1 output line. The select lines are used to select one of the input lines and produce the output. In a 4 cross 1 max, there are two select lines and four input lines. As we can see here, this is the truth table of a 4 cross 1 max. When the select line values are 0, 0, our I0 input terminal is selected. Similarly, for the all four cases, four different input terminals are selected. From the truth table, we got this equation y equal to i0 s1 s0 plus i1 s1 dash s0 plus i2 s1 s0 dash plus i3 s1 s0 now using this equation we are going to design our circuit first let's place a vcc and a ground okay now we'll place switches basic switch SPDT yeah okay let's remove the labeling all right done we'll need We'll need six of these switches, so simply copy and paste. Done. Now we'll connect these to VCC and ground. Change the color of the ground terminal. All right. Uh, we should give them their names. This is I sorry this is S zero this is S one S2 Oh sorry This is I0 I1 I2 Last one is I three. All right. Now we need to place two not gates. Go to TTL seven four LS zero four N. Done. 
uh, we'll need four three terminal and gates so 11 and okay and here and uh, four terminal or gate uh, there you go okay the labels is only one all right connect this to the not gate this also to the not gate now to do the wiring all right first go to i0 s1 s0 i0 s1 S1 is this side and S0 is here then I1 S1 dash S0 <clears throat> I1 S1 dash is the not gate and S0 uh, here then i2 s1 s0 dash i2 s1 s0 dash and i3 s1 s0 i'm sorry made a mistake here this is s1 dash s0 dash right so this and this this one goes yeah this goes yeah all right this is i3 s1 s0 so I3 S1 S0 Now connect these four AND gates to the four terminal or gate to place a probe so go to indicators any probe place all right let's name it uh, let's give it the name y right this is our circuit now let's simulate uh, let's place them all in off position 
all right for s1 and 0 or 0 0 we get out output at i0 so s1 is 0 0 0 i0 is 1 so we get our output now s1 is 0 is 0 and 1 0 and 1 you'll get it at i1 then 1 0 we get at i2 and 1 1 we get it i3 all right that's all for this tutorial see you next time